Uh, hey guys. Have a seat, take a seat. So, what has been troubling you two as of late? Well, you see, as you know, me and my roommate Sammy have been having some issues lately. We have not really been seeing eye to eye on some things. Oh? And what might those issues be? So, obviously, like we talked about last time, she's pretty. Yeah, yeah. She's pregnant, and... Yes, 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 yes. She is she uh, pregnant. Like okay, I remember that from us. She wants to get an abortion. Listen, I am done with this shit. You are not our first therapist. Abe made us switch again. No, listen, he, Sammy, we talked about this. We're not going to bring this our up. Our last it's therapist started saying things Abe didn't like, so we switched them. Is very troubling indeed. What kinds of things may I ask? Thank you. I don't know. Just like generally letting him get the better of me. I don't. I don't want him to get the better of me all the time. It's not fair. Not good. Our last therapist suggests we separate. We're not meant for each other. He said, and from the beginning, this wasn't gonna work out. So we did, but we still have to live together. He's, he's troubling, I can't, I don't know what to do. He's, he's, he's painful for me, that's why we're here. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, could you provide any specifics as to why that happened? And uh, how so is this coming up as an issue again? You two are split, correct? Yeah, we're split up now, but we still have to live with one another, and I'm just afraid he's getting the best of me. Our last therapist told us we represent very different goals. Abe is always going to be representative of a very unified and specific orthodox view, while I'm always trying to represent lots of views. Oftentimes views that aren't even, like, you can't fit them together. They're at ends with one another. Oftentimes they are religious. I can't, I can't do anything that he said... What he said was, God cannot favor two opposing causes, proponents that both believe they act in his name. However, the powers of the government should act in response to all the causes it represents. That's my job. I have to represent each of my proponents, each of the people that constitutes me. Not only that, but practitioners of politics, the democratic leaders that operate within me, could never claim one god or religion for their successes. Their constituency is of all walks and faiths. To claim one of their gods is solely dependent for their successes would be flat out wrong. From a believer standpoint, but even from a secular standpoint, I have to represent all my constituency, regardless of my personal beliefs. I can't let myself be controlled by Abe. I will become despotic if I do. This is a boundary I have to set. So this is why we decided to get a divorce like pretty quickly after getting married. There's, it's just, it does not gonna work out. Wow, yes, this is quite troublesome indeed. Now, uh, Abe, what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts on this? I'm sorry, Sammy. I didn't know you felt that way about it. I didn't understand quite how it was affecting you that way. Didn't you, though? Like, we went to therapy before, and that's why all this comes from. Stop trying to act. <laughs> hey, okay. okay. Stop oh, trying to act like you're listening it. now, okay? Oh, okay? I'm sorry, okay. I'm sorry, but I think it's time we hear from Abe now. If that's okay with you, Sammy? Yeah, that's fine. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, it's okay. I'm glad you feel comfortable enough to speak. Now, Abe, what do you feel about this? I actually have to agree with Sammy here. Uh, if I were to interrupt her ability to represent the people, admittedly, politics would become less democratic. Uh, 
I can see how this would be problematic. But, like, I don't know. I just can't give in. Like, there are some principles that have to be upheld. Human lives are at stake. Like, as God commands, peace be on earth. Oh, my God. Okay. All you say all this, but I don't believe you. You told me yourself all about your past with other governments. Back in France, pre-revolutionary, you told me you used to prefer monarchy. But now you say that you are the only, you are only about democracy. You flip flop too much, and I can't trust that. Listen, I know my past. I regret it. We bring the best out of each other, though. Like, like, do you not think that we're not compatible? Like, we are compatible. I understand if you are scared to be with me, given my past. I, monarchy was not a great idea. I, I know. I understand that now. But I've learned, like, now that I've learned, we are philosophically very cogent. Like, it's fine. That's not even Ethnicity what that word like, means. We're logically together. It makes sense. Whatever. Anyways, we agree on the treatment of others. Democracy is very Christian. It is the, like, ultimate way to love thy neighbor as yourself. It's... It's very cogent. Like, it's the same. It's good. Look, I'm pretty sure you mean well, but I can't trust that. Like I said, I can't. It's just, I can't. Okay, back on topic. Why are you, Sammy, feeling like Abe still has power over you, even though you were split up? Okay, well, look, I'm pregnant. I don't have, my family doesn't have, even Abe doesn't have the money to raise this kid. I work, I go to school full time. I simply can't afford this kid's survival. And frankly, I don't want it. I'm not ready. I'm not comfortable sharing how I got pregnant, but simply I don't wish to have and can't have this responsibility. But Abe keeps bickering at me to go through with it and refusing to drive me to a state where it's more accessible. It's not that I'm refi- <laughs> Hold on, hold on, Abe. Wait until she's done. Are you, are you done? Yes, sir. Okay, you may continue. It's not that I'm refusing to drive you. I just don't think you've considered the other options. It's just, there's other things that you need to think about here. Like, this doesn't need to be the case. Have you even thought about adopting? Have you thought about that? Like Yes, Abe, I don't think you understand. I don't want to go through with the child. It's not fun for me to admit. Just let me do what I want with my future. Can you future. stop freaking out at me? Don't make me out to be the bad guy here. I'm not the bad guy here. It's not my fault. Okay, good guy. Then who exactly is to blame? It is well-known facts that states that follow you and your god disproportionately support anti-abortion laws. It's just how it is. That's not entirely true. L legitimately, some studies suggest that it's not necessarily one's religious affiliation. It's their, like, personal beliefs. The, their personal belief in when, like, the soul or their life begins is when the fetus's life begins that is the issue. It doesn't have necessarily to do with the belief in God. Science can, like, anything can come to this, like, their own conclusions on this. It's not, like, my fault. And either way, it's not my fault that it's an immoral action. Oh my god, literally, your unsympathetic attitude towards my situation is laughable. Do you hear this? Yes, I do, frankly. I am still unclear as to your side. Would you please continue speaking about this, Sammy? Uh, specifically, sort of, what about this uh, unsympathetic attitude that uh, uh, you see he has? Abe, listen to me. You know full well your influence on specifically this issue of when life begins. What other institution is putting out this moral claim? And what about the studies that do show that? National Opinion Research Center found religio religiosity 
as measured by frequency of church attendance to be positively and significantly related to opposition to abortion. You play a role in this power over me and you cannot truthfully deny it. It's impossible. Fine. Even so, I can't give you any ground. God is in the right and I take the side of God. I can't, I can't help here. Like that's how it is. I can't deny that. This is exactly what I mean. Why it won't work ever between us. It's reality. I can't take the side of God. Doing so would be super problematic for the people. I must represent all of the other religious affiliates that support me. That don't take God's side. I have to give you and them room to breathe so y'all can coexist. I would hope you understand that. As well as understand that the need for me me to step outside of you and do my own thing. I can't let you control how I live. It would be terrible for everyone. Mm. Okay, okay. Well, I'm glad you guys got to share that. Perhaps I could offer uh, an outside perspective? Sure, sure by, by all, all means. means. So, Sammy, I, I see why you feel controlled. It was confusing at first for me because you two have on the surface separated, but really that seems that has just made the ways that Abe does have power in the dynamic more, say, invisible, so to speak. It's much less direct than it used to be, I'm sure, but that control is still there, might I add. I think it's separable. And perhaps, while maybe less powerful, still present. Sammy, I, I know it's hard to hear, but you two are inseparable in a way. In a way, I do think that's true. Abe represents not only an institution, but a way of life for these people. For these people, Abe is more than law, but reality. It is the fabric of things. It is the way that things are. And in so far as policy making and the policies you are trying to do, they seem heavily dependent on the sort of moral makeup of the democratic society that you are making them for, if I'm not mistaken. The uh, sort of moral makeup of the society is going to be influenced by uh, the social institutions of it. It's just matter of fact. Um, especially institutions like the church that are so powerful and have such a heavy hand within our social fabrics. Even I, as a non-believer of God, will admit that the moral values and things I was taught in Sunday school guide me to this day. Anyways, I'm sure things will improve. I'm sure. I'm glad that you can hear out each other's side. It is very important. Communication is key. Sadly, uh, it does, however, look like our time is up. So thank you guys so much for your time. You'll just uh, sign here and uh, here to uh, register you for the next visit. I would be more than happy to hear from y'all again. Your name's uh, Sammy and Gabe, correct? No, it's uh, ah. Abe. Oh, a Abe, my bad. Well, great to see you. Uh, have thank a minute you, on your way out, you. by the way. Thank you. Oh, I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate it. Ah, uh, they forgot to shut the door.